pears are at the height of their season right now and they're so delicious and so juicy and sweet. I've been slicing them up and we've been having them for dessert because they're so delicious. But yesterday I sliced up a few too many we couldn't eat so I put them in the refrigerator overnight. You can see they got a little bit brown. Now this is the brown skin pear called a Bosque pear and they have this special flavor. It almost tastes like white wine. And so today I thought rather than just eat them by the slice because they're kind of past their prime as far as looks go. So I'm going to put them in a grilled cheese sandwich and I'll show you how I'm going to do that. I've got my bread sliced already and I'm just going to spread some butter. Well actually I'm using ghee today if you like ghee. And I'm going to do one side of this bread and then I'm going to set it in my pan which I've got heating. And then I'm going to put just a little bit of this ghee right over the bread in the pan and I'm going to start building my sandwich. So first some cheese and just use slices of your favorite cheese. Lay that on the bread, cover the whole bread up and then I'm going to put my pear slices over the cheese. So I think I'll just center these right down my slice of bread. Then I'm going to sprinkle some sunflower seeds over the pear in the cheese to give it a little crunch. I just love that texture. And it adds a little bit of saltiness too. And then a little more cheese. So I'm building it right in my pan. And then I'm just going to put a little bit of ghee right on this bread. Yeah, and then set this right on top. Kind of smash it down a little bit and then cover the top. And I'm going to let it brown. I like to put it over a little bit low heat so that the cheese has plenty of time to melt before the bread gets too dark when it's toasting. Once your sandwich is toasted on both sides, just gently take it out of the pan with the spatula, put it on your cutting surface and just cut straight through it. Oh, and you've got this delicious pear, cheese, and sunflower seed sandwich. That's a nice change if you're getting a little bored with your lunch sandwiches. I'm Sue Doden sharing Good Food for Good Life 365.